It's Monday, y'all. Wanna feel proud? Listen up, listen up. Welcome to another Monday motivational video. Oh, yeah. Got one life to live, man. Welcome to another Monday motivational. It's it's Monday, it's time to get hype. I wanna feel pride and I don't wanna take This is hard, boy. I wanna live better days. Never look back and say could have been me. It could have been me. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, dude. What is up, everybody? Welcome to another Monday motivational live stream. I do Monday motivational videos every single Monday at 9 p.m. EST. That is 9 p.m. Eastern time because I feel like Mondays are a day that a lot of people fall down. Don't look forward to the week. Don't look forward to Mondays. And I'm trying to help motivate you and helping you understand that Monday just means it's a new start to a new week, to a new you, to a new day that you can work hard to become the person you want to be, to achieve the goals that you're working towards, etc. If you are new to this channel, then hit that subscribe button because I am on a mission to create a community that loves each other, that supports each other, that openly talks about depression, anxiety, low self-esteem, that helps you transform your mindset to empower, inspire, and transform your mindset so that way you can achieve any goal, any obstacle that's in your way. All right, so let's just jump right into it, y'all. This is a really heavy subject. What's the point of being here, right? Why, why are we here? What's the point, you know? There's been multiple times in my life I've gone, through, I've thought about that, and this video was is here because it's time for. <laughs> What's up, Justin? Welcome to the live stream, bro. <laughs> um, so to put it the best way, I have. I wanted to, to create a platform that I can openly, when I first started this YouTube channel, I wanted to help people that suffer with depression, anxiety, and low self-esteem. And I feel like as time has progressed, I still help people that suffer with that, but I wasn't really being real with myself and how I struggle with uh, clinical depression. So if you're new to this channel, please understand. So I, I have clinical depression, okay? I have suffered from depression since Middle school, that's when I can really remember. I may even remember in elementary school, I just always wasn't feeling happy, right? But throughout time of my journey in life, I feel like I had overcome this. And I realized <laughs> recently that I haven't, and that it's something that is a part of who I am. So this channel is here because I want to help continue to impact people that do suffer with depression, anxiety, low self-esteem. All the titles, I look back, all the titles of the videos I've created that help people transform their mindsets, it's like little breadcrumbs. Because the reason why those videos were created is because I was dealing with depression and I wanted to overcome those obstacles with you. So I got a little note sheet here. So the first thing I wanted to openly say, so that way you understand I'm being real and authentic is that I do have clinical depression and it feels good to like admit that and say that out loud because I think for a while I just I didn't want to believe it you know what I'm saying I didn't want to believe that I had depression and because you know people see me as this bubbly happy guy and I'm not putting on a fake persona at all <laughs> I'm smiling right now I can't help it um, but that does not mean that internally or in my mindset that I'm not going through things. So the second one is that I just want to help you understand that if you suffer with these things, you are not alone. So when you feel like there's no point in you being here anymore, that's not true. Um, now, don't get me wrong. There are times where I felt like, and maybe you've gone through this experience too, that there's no point anymore. You don't have a purpose. You don't know what you feel like doing. You're not happy doing anything in your life, etc. And oh snap, occasionally random Disney, what is up? Welcome to the live stream. I'm happy to see you here. <laughs> um, but 
as hard as for me to say like right now, I think that what keeps me going when recently I had a very low moment where I felt like I didn't want to be here anymore and it got it got really bad and dark. And my parents were there supporting me like crazy and I was crying and all that stuff. And then I told them, I said, the only thing that's keeping me here is I don't want life to win. Because for me to say life beat me and now I don't want to be here, it's like that's not it's like it's like I lost, right? And if you're a competitive person like I am, I'm like, bump that. I'm not freaking losing against this life, right? So for you, if you feel like you're like, what's the point of being here? Just understand if anything you can hold on to is a few things. One thing, don't let life win. Don't let life win. Don't let it beat you. Don't let hardships, financial struggles, loneliness, uh, relationships, whether you're in a relationship that's unhappy or you're single and you're, un and you're unhappy and you wish you were in a relationship, breakups, having no friends, having the wrong friends. Don't let any obstacle in life beat you. That's life. Life's, life can be very hard. It can, there's, there are moments that are beautiful, but life can be very hard. Don't let it win. Don't let it beat you, all right? The second reason is because if you choose not to be here, okay, think about the lifelong damage and pain that you're going to be, going to be bringing to your close ones. They're always going to be thinking about you. They're always going to be missing you, and they're going to be heartbroken and sad and say, wow, like that person's not here anymore. So you've actually left, maybe you left some pain for yourself, temporary pain that could subside, but you've left a lifelong pain for somebody that loves you. So keep that mindset that it's not, you're not the only, like you're not going to be just getting rid of your pain. All you're doing is creating a huge amount of pain for a lot of people close around you if you choose not to be here. So stay strong through that. And the third reason, is it's hard and I know it's hard to see this one but just keep breathing and keep going um, you can sometimes feel like at least for me I was like why, why would I want to continue you know f dealing with life and dealing with the down moments and having to fight like you get tired right you're like my gosh because you see if you don't okay so if you don't struggle with depression this, this is what kind of we go through we see other people that suffer with the that don't suffer with depression right and we go up to them and they're naturally happy like they don't even have to try as hard they don't even have to give as much effort to focus on happiness focus on the positive positive things i literally ask people i'm like do you ever get down they're like yeah but it's like temporary it's only a moment and they get they're happy again or they're 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 at a good level and it's like wow like really like <laughs> It's that easy, right? To smile for you to just be happy. So that's what it's like with depression. So the third thing again is just just continue going, continue going forward. So I recently made an announcement about this on this channel about me. It came I came back from a month and and I had said that this channel is going to be continuing with you know helping people with their mindset. I said I was going to be going to be changing my slogan and there's a lot of things on my mind. I'm, I'm actually not going to be changing my slogan. It's going to be do you, stay swagalicious, and keep smiling because that's who I am. That's how I started this channel, and that's how I'm going to continue doing this channel. Um, also, I have changed it to Depression Talks with Emmanuel because there, it's, it's time for me to use what I could view as a negative to help more people and use it for a positive. Because there are so many people, maybe you're one, one of these people, there are so many people that deal with sadness, that deal with laziness, that deal with unhappiness, loneliness, you know, nerves, anxiousness, and feel like they're alone in this. And I feel like we live in a society that in social media, on TV, let's put out our best moments where we're smiling and happy and everything is okay, right? We, nobody goes through problems. They just posted a picture on Instagram they're on a beach. They're just posted a picture on Facebook that they're with their family at a family function and having a blast. They just got engaged. They just did the day, they, 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 right? Everybody's posting their most, their best moments. But on this channel, I'm going to be posting how I feel in terms of depression. 
But also, I'm going to show you, I'm going to show you that no matter how depressed you get, no matter how down you get, you can take action and you can still live life and keep fighting. And that's what this channel is all about. Creating that community that can openly talk about the issues that everybody at some point in their lives go through, but are so afraid to talk about because they want to be viewed as a weak, vulnerable, they don't, they don't want to be hurt, they don't want, they, they're scared to talk about it because, oh, I'm not supposed to talk about my feelings or whatever. Not here. You're completely open to say anything that you need to. You can ask any question. You are not alone in whatever struggle you're going through. So if you're saying to yourself, what's the point of being here? Well, guess what? You have a place now. If you didn't have one before, you have a place now that you can openly talk about your issues. All right. And the last thing I really want to say is thank you. <laughs> thank you. Um, this channel has gotten to where it is today because of your support and your help and your consistency, your comments, your likes, you're coming back to the live streams, you're, you know, you're, you're sending me messages, you're sending me emails, and I just want to say thank you because this channel wouldn't, wouldn't be what it is today without your help. And plus, excuse me, and plus, you coming back to these videos and you supporting me, it makes me smile, it makes me, it gives me it like feeds my purpose, it feeds my reason to be here because it helps me realize, yo, I'm here to help other people. So thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for continuously supporting my channel, no matter the changes. If you deal with depression, you understand sometimes it's not easy. Um, there are times when, there are times when I'm, I'm for example, this past Sunday, I was going to shoot a lot of videos for y'all and I, I mentally couldn't do it. I was feeling down. I was really down. And um, I think in those moments, that's when I need to shoot a video. But I didn't want to have to be strong. It was like too hard for me to be strong on the camera for you guys. So I was like, you know what? Next time, I'm going to record what's on my heart in that moment about my depression. And it's going to be OK, because somebody else, maybe you, are going through the same similar thing. So overall, y'all. Thank you so much again for supporting me on this channel. Please understand that even though I do say, you know, depression talks with the manual, I'm not saying that every single video is going to be, oh, this is depression, depression, sadness, sadness. No, it's going to be, I, it's going to be struggling with loneliness uh, due to depression or struggling with being single and how to overcome it or struggling with, or, 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 I went to work, I worked out today, even though I did not feel like it, since I felt sad, right? There's so many reasons why we don't do what we want to do. And for me in particular, the biggest thing in my way is my clinical depression. So thank you. Uh, real quickly before I go, I'm always making sure that during these live streams, I make sure I give uh, an opportunity for you to ask me questions. You can ask me questions throughout the live streams, of course. but. I just want to make sure you understand I'm engaging with you. This is not just about me. This is about us fighting for life, fighting forward, striving forward, staying strong, no matter how bad life may seem to get. So right now, are there any questions uh, that deal with you? Like, are you suffering? Are you sad right now? Are you unhappy right now? Do you have anxiety? Um, is there something that you're like, how do I handle this situation? I'm not saying I'm an expert, but what I can say is that being, ha having, having to handle clinical depression for 20 years, 24 years of my life now, I can say that at least I may be able to speak upon it and say how I handle it. I'm not saying this is what you should do. This is how you, oh yeah, you just focus on the positive and do that. I'm simply saying, how can I help and share my experience with you? So are there any current questions that you uh, need some help with at all? Uh, and while you, if you comment, while you do that, I am, my birthday is going to be coming up soon. It's going to be May 22nd. May 22nd, I will be 25 years old. I know I look 25 years young minus 10 years. I know I get that a lot. I look like 18 or 21. I got that. But I'm about to be 25 in May. Um, I'm excited. <laughs> so I'm hoping that some special things may come out around my birthday time that I can't tell y'all. But stay tuned. 
could be an ebook, who knows? I mean, it could be a whole entire website where I do, you know, one on one, you know, talk sessions, stuff like that. But I, I, I don't know. Just don't quote me on that. <laughs> um, but yeah, if you have any um, gifts, you know, you want to send me, comment down below. Maybe it can be a gift of a hug, a virtual hug. It could be a gift of, you know, you can send me anything. You can send me emails. You can send me um, money. <clears throat> you don't have to send me that. So, <laughs> I just want to say it's our birthday. As I can see, there's no questions here. Um, so, I hope that y'all have a great, great week. It is Monday Motivational. What's the point of being here? You have to continue to fight. You have to continue to stay strong. It is hard as heck. I know. It is hard. Dang. But you got to, man. Because you don't want life to win. You got to beat life. I love y'all. Stay positive. And as I always say, <laughs> do you stay swagalicious <laughs> and keep smiling no matter how hard it is. Peace. Have a good week, y'all. Stay classy.